Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Trump's new border plan shakes Washington swamp, sends undocumented scrambling. President Trump suggested a plan that is sure to send illegal aliens scrambling and it provoked an uproar out of the swamp and the left almost immediately. Frankly, I'm all for it. He's suggesting that illegal aliens not be given constitutional rights and due process in court. That they should just be immediately deported. I have a few thoughts on this one. It's true that the Supreme Court ruled that any person who is on American soil has constitutional rights. But that doesn't make the ruling correct and personally, I don't think that is ever what the Founding Fathers intended. They intended our rights to be applied to American citizens. Therefore, I would agree with putting these illegal aliens on a bus and immediately sending them back where they came from. I am not in the majority on this opinion, unfortunately. Judge Napolitano disagrees with me and says they do have rights. But he also points out there is an easy fix to all this. Just don't let them over the border in the first place. If we had a wall and security, that would be the case. Until we can get there, according to SCOTUS, these people must be adjudicated. This means housing and providing for tens of thousands of them. It is untenable and a horrific mess. Brought to you by Democrats and progressive Republicans alike. Americans, when they stray into Mexico, are arrested, tortured, beaten and treated abysmally. They do not have the same rights as Mexican citizens do. I'm not saying we should treat illegal aliens as the Mexicans do. We should be fair and humane. But we should not treat them as if they are actual Americans and the president agrees with that. Although yesterday he did concede that it would be more workable to just prevent them from coming across the border and to transport them back to wherever they came from. Trump's zero-tolerance immigration policy is the right call here to be used against those who don't respect the rule of law. I support the move 100 percent. From Reuters. President Donald Trump said on Sunday that people who enter the United States illegally should be sent back immediately to where they came from without any judicial process, likening them to invaders who are trying to break into the country. His proposal drew immediate criticism from legal analysts and immigrant rights advocates who said it would violate the U.S. Constitution's due process provision, which applies to citizens and non-citizens alike. In a series of tweets on Sunday, Trump said, We cannot allow all of these people to invade our country. When somebody comes in, we must immediately, with no judges or court cases, bring them back from where they came. Cannot accept all of the people trying to break into our country. Strong borders, no crime. They are invaders and they have declared that is what they intend to do. If you listen to the current leading candidate for the presidency in Mexico, he is urging Mexican citizens to go to the U.S. to basically invade and conquer America. They see it as taking back land they claim is theirs. In my book, that is an act of a war. I also do not share in the sentiment that illegal alien children should be reunited with their parents. We do not do that when Americans break the law and go to prison. That's just insane. I'm not alone in thinking this way. Many legal scholars support my point of view. Especially constitutional originalists. Dinesh D'Souza, a man I greatly respect, stated during a Fox News interview that, citizenship is a kind of bargain among citizens of a country, and it comes from a social contract with certain rights and responsibilities. The whole idea of letting non-citizens vote and shape the governmental process falls outside the social contract. They need to go through the citizenship process, become citizens, and then they get the protections and benefits of being a citizen. That's what my son-in-law did. He's from Denmark and we spent several years getting him over here illegally. He adopted my daughter's children and is now a citizen. It took a lot of effort, time and money, but it was the right thing to do and I'm very proud of him. Democrats know all this. That's not the point. They want open borders so they have a permanent voting bloc to utilize in politics. It's power for them. They don't care about illegal immigrants' children. But they use that for their political agenda. This has gone on for far too long. A wall needs to be built, border security truly enforced and the rule of law upheld. Without borders and without the rule of law, we are not really a sovereign nation and the left knows that. President Trump is absolutely correct that they need to be sent back. This lawfare over illegal immigration that is weaponized by the left has to stop. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.